Start auditing the excuses you're allowing yourself to believe. They just aren't true. And I've got zero respect for any excuse, for anything that's ultimately supposed to be pushing you forward, but you're allowing to hold you back. You know, Tom Shea, when he talks about excuses, he talks about the fact that they're subtle, seductive, and believable. Subtle as they just creep in out of nowhere. Like, oh, you can, you can eat that fast food. And then the seductive part about it is like when you start really believing it. Seductive when you start thinking about, man, spicy chicken sandwich, some french fries would be fantastic right now. And it starts becoming seductive. The second it becomes believable, it's over. You're not going to do it. But the second it becomes believable, you're done. Subtle, seductive, and believable. That's what excuses are. But if you carry that do it anyway mentality, it'll eliminate those opportunities for those excuses to subtly slip in. Um, and it'll ultimately help you win the day. Any excuse when it comes out of your mouth, it is you putting the blame for your lack of something right. on something else or someone else or yep. some system or whatever that may be. So take Product, that and flip it. Product, company, the economy, the whatever it so is. So take that and flip it and, and throw a, what can I do to make this situation better so that I don't feel this way? Or what can I do to increase my sales? What can I do to close more of these leads that I'm getting? Not these leads are crap. What can I do to close these leads? You start realizing the excuses that you would use for not going to the gym, the excuses that you would use for maybe deviating from your diet, the excuses that you would use for not reading those 10 pages because you're tired and you want to go to sleep are the same excuses that you're using in every other area of your life. But the reality is, and I think Andy Frisella was the first person that I heard really talking about this a lot and I've adopted it ever since, this whole idea of do it anyway, is the fact that nobody cares how you feel. Nobody cares how you feel. If you said you were going to do something, you go do it. Period. End of story. Look at those things that you're not doing and, and try to be self-aware enough to realize what your excuses are and to be able to just kind of like make that, make that realization of like, huh, I'm not doing this right now because I just said this is stupid, I don't need to do this. I encourage you and I challenge you, look at the excuses that you're using in your life. And I guarantee the same excuse that could have been used tonight as to why I don't need to be working out when it's 3 a.m. back home is the same excuse that you're using for every single other area of your life that's lacking. I just challenge you with that and hope it, uh, hope it sinks in.